Dracula. Die now and leave this world. You'll never belong here. Oh, but this world invited me. Your own kind called me forth with praise and tribute. Tribute? You're a thief. You steal men's souls, their freedom. Freedom is always sacrificed to faith, good hunter. Or are you truly here by choice? All I'm here for is you. To hell with your heresy! You're nothing but a blight on mankind. Ha! Mankind. A cesspit of hatred and lies. Fight for them, then, and die for their sins! <laughs> Priest Shaft to menace humanity once again. The legendary vampire hunter, Richter Belmont, stood against him and at last brought him down. However, four years later, on a glaring full moon night, Richter mysteriously vanished. Maria Renard set out to find him, but knew not where to begin. It was then that fate intervened. Castlevania, the castle of Dracula, rumored to appear once every century, suddenly materialized from the mist, as if to show her the way. Meanwhile, powerful forces struggled for the soul of a man named Alucard. He who had once fought alongside Trevor Belmont against his own immortal father, Count Dracula himself. To purge the world of his own cursed bloodline, Alucard had submerged his vampiric powers and fallen into what was meant to be eternal slumber. But now, he awakens to the cackles of evil and cries of the innocent. The eternal battle of good and evil has come full circle once more. Dracula's castle beckons for you. And no man can say who will emerge victorious. Thank <laughs> you. 
your business here? I've come to put an end to this. Everly insolent boy. But there will be no games here. If you will not behave, be gone. I will do neither. Step aside, old man. Ha! <laughs> Such arrogance. Very well. But I shall see you very soon.
Vor langer Zeit lebten die Menschen glücklich und zufrieden. Niemand bemerkte den Schatten, der sich langsam über ihnen ausbreitete. Die Dunkelheit trübte ihre Sinne und das Böse fraß sich tief in ihre Seelen. Vom Wahnsinn getrieben schmiedeten sie einen Pakt mit dem Teufel. Zu später Stunde kamen sie zusammen, um gemeinsam die Mächte der Finsternis mit ihrem sündigen Blut zu rufen. Sie zu erlösen von ihrer sterblichen Existenz, den Anbeginn einer neuen Welt vor Augen. Und so begab es sich, dass nach 100 Jahren das Böse wieder Fleisch geworden war. Als unsterbliches Geschöpf der Nacht kam es die Gestalt des Wolfs, der Fledermaus oder des Nebels annehmen. Es labt sich am Blut der Menschen. Dracula, der Fürst der Finsternis, Herr des Teufelsschlosses, ist auferstanden.
Thank you. 